Hello everyone and welcome back to Altrius playing Darkest Dungeon in the estate that I'm unable to rename so let's just roll with it. I can rename these dudes but I ain't gonna just right now. Uh, we've got better things to do which is to play the game. Um, I am reticent to send any of these people out again so what we might want to think about doing is to put them in for... Well, I don't know. I mean we could wait for them to flip out completely. That's possibly the best way of doing it. I am aware that, of course, much like Anzare here, if you put them in for stress relief, you might not actually get back down to zero, so waiting for them to get up to 100% is not always the greatest of ideas in the first place. We can't put Dismas anywhere anyway, because the, the, somehow the game has endeavoured to give me both Known Cheat, which is now very difficult to get rid of, and Gambler, which is not very easy to get rid of, uh, not very difficult to get rid of, but I can't get rid of either of them anyway because we haven't unlocked the Sanitarium. So <clears throat> I think our best thing to do here might be to... Oh, is that what that means? <laughs> yeah. Which is expensive. So maybe we want to increase stress recovery in the transept before... And dogmatic rituals. Okay. Some atomic before we do it. Um, that costs a little bit in terms of these majiggers, and we do have these open now, so maybe we Make really no want to look at this first. Mind we you, face ever greater threats. we should Our probably keep increasing ready. the cheapiness of this. The bellows blast once again. The forge stands ready um, to make weapons of war. Can I... how much does it cost to make four of those? I can get... Oh, that's a decent exchange. Let's do that. Then we can do this. I want to save the flames, mold the metal. Um, money where possible. Uh, and of course these fellows can be upgraded right now and these ones cannot I believe. So I'm thinking maybe we bring out the new people and then let's let's take Anzare Anzare who is um, most uh, will not, end up here covered in the poisoned earth. Um, the you're going in here oblivion. to increase in time, well, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. Let's mostly focus on th this way. What? Instruct a mastery level once. We have to do this. Oh, mate. Well, <laughs> we're not going to do any of that. Can we upgrade? I'm assuming by the same token, we're not going to be able to increase your armor. Ah, we can do that. Uh, yeah. So... In fact, I assume that this would be sufficient. Oh, it's not even got one level. I understand. So you can't actually do anything until you've got enough things for that. So let's just embark, I suppose. Um, what did we win here? Oh. Nothing amazing. We do have a Houndmaster skill. Did we take a Houndmaster? Can we take a Houndmaster? Why don't you go away? There we go. No. Um, we don't have any of those people. So let's wait for them to show up rather than doing anything interesting right now. You lot leave. Don't need you. We will put... The Arbalest will probably want to go at the back. Makes some sense. And the Bounty Hunter goes at the front. I hope. He uh, doesn't like it that much at the front. But well, here's one thing we can do. Is we can... Have you got what I want? Yes. You've got Duelist Advance, which is actually a really good thing because... It means that if you can somehow gain speed, not this, if we can get this unit to have speed, then they can often go first, do the advance, and I would, I mean, often you want to sort of do the the retreat as well. Yeah, this one. So this duelist advance and this point blank shot work together to move your um, unit between the second space and the first space. Although you're... Uh, nice. Um, so this one would start at the front, but that's okay. They can do a lot from the front if necessary, and from the second position they're much better. Which means we need a healer, and you can go in the third position. Should be fine for you. Can we drop? There we go. I mean, it's not ideal. <coughs> Often I think it's best to try and get your skills as useful in the position you're putting in as possible. By the way, I have had a drink since the last episode, and it's not working, and I'm going to drink some more. 
but my throat is still croaky and apparently lubrication is not this is not the correct lubrication uh, lubrication itself probably is good enough so I think we have the ones that we want from this position which is healing and then a stun so you might as well keep the stun thingy and then we basically got nothing <laughs> none of these people can take the rest of the trinkets but that's okay we do tend to win a trinket from each each mission and I think this is a fine setup we don't have any you have bleed right oh I want this this is bleed so this is a good one for just DPS which means we could go to the wield but I don't think we have the healing against all the poison and blight that exists in there and there's a we're going to have to fight a lot, so I'm going to not do that. I'm going to stick to the scouting ones just mostly because <laughs> it's, it's easier, although we could. Is this better? What is this, Crusader? That might be worth taking. And then this will give us deeds. I think they all give you deeds. Oh, no. I, want, I want crests. Okay, I'm going to do this one because we can if we want to avoid um, combat, a lot of the time anyway, and there's some good stuff in here that we can bring back if we take the correct provisions. Maybe we should take a little bit more of that. Uh, I'm assuming that this Laudanum... Do you know what? This is new to me, so let's uh, let's Google it together. Darkest Dungeon Lord Dunham. Lord Dunham. Official Darkest Dungeon and Whiskey. I got it. I understand your cookies. Used to purge horror. This is it. Which does happen, actually. It happened quite a lot in the last episode, so. It's not inexpensive, so maybe we do that. Um, is it better than just tanking it? I guess we'll take it in case someone gets so stressed out that it's a big deal, but um, yeah, I've got nothing else. Let's go. Really need to get those the blacksmith and the guildmaster graded because we nearly we really need the units to be upgraded. I'm going to drink. Drink my water and begin. Face out the halls of your lineage once familiar. Now, Oren. You are gonna do this. Yeah, good start. Wrong one, but at least we're getting there. Are you gonna trap? I'm expecting a trap. Trap? Trap. No trap. I think I bring enough torture murations, but this um five Five unit haul is new since the last time we played. So we want to. What's this gonna do? Activates repost. I was telling you about that. Was I not? In the previous episode. This is what we want to see. So you hit me and then I hit you. Perfect. So this is gonna deal a lot of damage as long as people attack this unit, which is not guaranteed necessarily. We do have an extra heal uh, available in in the moment if necessary. Uh, damage versus marks, but see, this, uh, I'm actually going to use this on you because of the debuff. This unit dodges way too much to be uh, helpful, and oh, of course you're back there. These two can actually work with each other, so we're going to have to try and figure that one out. I'm going to stun you as well if I possibly can. You've got the stun trinket, but maybe you shouldn't have it. Yeah, because if you've got nothing else to do, you're going to be stunning things. Things that haven't had a go yet. So you're more likely to have something to do than you are. Ah, uh, maybe. Early on. <laughs> Hopefully. So this has put us in a position where two units can attack the Christ out of this one, and we can get away with... I was going to say no, but obviously minimal. Ah, uh, no. Stress. That's good. Everyone's on 20% for some reason. I know this. We can tank the bleeding at this stage. That's no problem. Um, meh. Does it actually do any damage? Two to three. I don't think it's necessary. Send you to the back. Okay, send you to the grave. 
where you belong. This fight's starting off okay. Setting that up is probably a good idea, but if we can get one, because if this unit has nothing, oh my voice! If this unit has, no, if this unit has nothing to do, um, that's particularly useful, like collecting bounty versus marks or whatever, it can mark for the arbalist on the next round. Also, it has damage versus stunned. So if we manage to stun something, which doesn't get to have a go until the next round. I mean, everyone might as well have some HP right now. Um, if we can <clears throat> get a stun before you get a go, you have a choice of whether to mark, collect the mark, like that. Destroy. I wish these things would <laughs> go away. We don't have a corpse removal system unit thingy. Uh, and all you can do is really shoot the back. All you can do to the back is really shoot it. Uh, it's kind of what I meant there. And I think at this point we... Oh, okay. Um, it's not good enough. <laughs> Everyone get a little bit more healed. We might as well top us all off a little bit than overheal one person. This will probably do it. Yep. So we're working out a little bit of a, a tactic here, but what we're really hoping for... But a victory, At least in the future, is a speed amulet that will let us kind of fix the dice rolls for who goes in which order, because this is the correct order for now. I tried to zoom out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and they're surprised, which is great for us, because... Um, well, we know now that the stun is gonna not wear off until this unit gets a go, okay? So what we might want to do like your, your uh, versus stun can hit the middle the, the third unit and your stun can hit the third unit. So we can probably finish this thing off just by stunning it which means we can mark this one for death or just So now we have a choice. Do we want to kill that one really hard or that one really hard, basically? So we, uh, presuming this stun takes. And the worst case, if that doesn't die, still doesn't get a go. So I think that's probably worthwhile. Uh, yeah. Whew. Not good enough, but basically on death's door. Don't have grape shot blast. We could finish this one off like this, actually. That seems like a good idea. That, that was well worth it. I don't know if it only has seven HP anyway, so your attack was well, your attack was unnecessary, but we couldn't rely on that being a full eight. You know? Yes. See how much I like Riposte. Even if they miss, you still get to own them. <laughs> you got nothing on me. So we'll stun and mark, and then Bouncy Hunter can either do one or the other. Point black shot. Back to Step the back again. Pit. Back in the right order, and you might as well make use of the mark. That was a great fight. With impunity. That's exactly the way a fight should go. Obviously, we had a great advantage. Success so clearly in view, or is it merely a uh, trick of the light? I don't think we have any holy water, or maybe we just like can use this. Let's try it. Yeah, nice. Plenty of damage. There's a decent amount, uh, and it's the right unit to have done it with. There's a bit of a dice roll on that one as well, because you don't know if the buff that you get, if you do get a buff, I'm not sure if that's guaranteed, uh, is going to be appropriate to the unit that you apply it to. Empty. Someone's been here before. Let's light the torch before we go into combat. Good idea. More surprise. This one is going to be a lot easier. I think we can probably just, like, shoot them. <laughs> Quite honestly. Use your keyboard, it's easier. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Oh, heck. Uh, you'll do this. A little stab. And then if that ever gets a go, which it shouldn't, we might as well, um, what have we got here? Might as well just top you off. I'm a little bit used, not that I'm complaining, but I'm kind of used to the healer having a 
couple of trinkets that seize this moment have to improve push on to the task their healing end. ability so healing up to five and of course usually they're um you know leveled up as well so two at once on the same person this is a bit rude I don't know if you always attack the third place why is everyone getting a go before me I guess I'm okay with it um, if I put a mark on this one then you should be able to hit it if necessary no so I will put a mark on this one I'd rather do damage to a unit to bring it out of the game than to you know specifically target something like that if I can stun this one we can then you we could basically always want to do this uh, uh, you kill that okay don't and now we have the option for this unit to completely eradicate that one and also shuffles which is nice but I don't think it um, it, it doesn't destroy corpses like other shuffles nice on well I don't really mind if you resist that backwards move actually because you can always just like we're gonna, I'm gonna do this to you anyway. I want to knock back you, but I can't. Hmm. Okay. That was a lot of damage, actually, for something that has high protection. If you wanted to dodge these a little bit more, then we can deal with less stress at the end of the game. That would be grand. Uh, I'm gonna heal myself. Healer, heal thyself. Oh. Yeah. Oh, crit. I could have done with that on the other one if I'd known. It's okay. That's probably a good idea, actually, because now we're back down. Uh, let's try and just... Oh, I was hoping for a one-shot, obviously. We can't reach anything. Let's just kill this. <laughs> so we don't have much uh, attack against this one, so it's going to have another go. Because, oh, we do. Nice. And that's why Repost is so good. Did I not get the Remind yourself that stress from it? Is a slow and insidious killer. That would be nice. Heirlooms, please. We've got a key back. And a bit of money, but hoping for more shields, because it's the shields that we need. What are they called? Shields. Raise shields. In I'm hungry now. Find victory. The game made me hungry. Uh, we haven't got any herbs, and I think herbs is best on that. Bit of a meta game. Playing the game the next time, knowing what you're doing. It's the same as reading the wiki, just remembering it, I guess, but reasonably sure that are we in the right order yes. <laughs> reasonably sure that that's a herbs sort of situation why don't you oh not you you read this yeah 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 oh that's okay you're not coming with us on the next one anyway stop talking these rogue characters can't can't silence them. Just do what they want. Uh, I don't like you being so... How about you read again and see if you flip out completely. <laughs> okay. <laughs> fine. Oh, he's got a tad left. Oh. Alright, fine. Those who covered injury find it in no short supply. Okie dokie. Well. Yeah, he's... Announcer boy is not wrong. You're gonna find yourself very... Um, <laughs> very well looked after if masochism Masterfully is your goal. Executed. You don't get much stress back in this game. So now we'll heal you. So that's where I needed that crit. Healing, of course, does have a bit of a drawback in as much as that person has not done any damage to anything. And now... It's a grave nibble. Vertigo, great. What does that mean? And a stun. Just keep going for the same guy. It's not going to be a problem. Don't even know if the Arbust is a male character or a female character. I don't know if it matters. Fine. They, they're going to have a heart attack if this continues. <laughs> That's the problem here. Uh, sure. These don't leave corpses, which is really nice. Die. Rather kill one for certain than 
have a chance that the other one doesn't die and that we have to deal with two on the next round. Of course, we resist the stun. We haven't got 100% against it, and we don't have real much of a buff except for the. Green ears. Blurred vision. The end approaches. We're okay. Stop being so melodramatic. Although that was probably the hardest fight so far with just a few bugs. Ooh. Last room, and we're done. How's it a 20 minute video already? Didn't do that much, did I? Oh, hi. We're surprising them a lot. We haven't even got a buff to that. So we'll activate Repost immediately. It's basically not worth not doing. In my opinion. Uh, I don't like you going first, to be fair. This is the one versus Marked. Which is only those two. That's both of those two. Ooh, plus 20% healing received. I didn't realise that. You do that. That was actually more than enough healing to begin with. <laughs> I want you to not have a go. Because I don't like you. You two can't hit any further back than is a problem, but you can. Could you actually hit that? Wow. <laughs> well done. Here's me just pondering, going, hang on. Hang on a minute, this guy's dead. Not dead. Should have put the mark on, which was my original plan. Put Use this bounty hunter to put the mark on so that the arbalist can shoot it. Um, well, plus 20% is still... Plus 20%, I guess. That is a good attack. I do like that one. Hit this one. <laughs> it's back. Well, I hit that when he dodges, but still. Dodge. What? A dizzying blow to body and brain. You have no... You're not welcome here. Oh, we can still put this on, though. Let's do that. Mark this joker for death, and then this... Plonker can actually shoot it. Press 1. There we go. Decimated. Ha! I think that was a bit of a tit-for-tat sort of thing, if you don't mind me saying so, Google Deep Mind. And you're dead? You're dead. Um, can we heal this? <laughs> I appreciate the enemy being These dead, creatures but at the same time, they can be beaten. I'd like the opportunity to heal that person. There's no more attacks. There's no more uh, Finding the stuff is only the first battles. Test. So now I think we could home. get a refund a little bit on that. Let's get out of here. Whew. Didn't like that. Didn't like that at all. A I think we gave 110% Frank. To us. But even then... And we will find whatever secrets they we didn't hold. find hardly any heirlooms, even though we took all the stuff we should have given us to us. Good. Warren's Tactician. Fine. We'll only drink. I think that's okay. I mean, oftentimes we find that we filled up the... There slots in those places as well. Reynold is back to normal. Revia, it does reset you to 100% at the end of the thing, which is nice. At least I think that's what it's telling me. Are you I mean, you're just so bad. I could just, like, make you go away. Do you know what? Let's see if we've got another Arbalest. I've got an Antiquarian, which is going to be really good. But I do like a Hellion as well. In which case, we just find more space. More arrive, foolishly seeking for. Let's take a Hellion and Antiquarian. In this domain of the damned. We might have a left trinket, actually. No. We did just win an Arbalist trinket. Wait, what was that first one? Antiquarian. I think I know what my <laughs> playstyle is, which is basically everything. That does damage in a mean way. A lawman and his faithful beast, a bond forged by battle Let's take everybody. and bloodshed. Because I, I don't think you're worth keeping. I know you're resolve level one now, but get out of it. Those without the stomach for this place must move on. That's exactly my sentiment. You are not helping. Like even Anzare here is still good to go out. I think. Um, I'm happy to go on another. Another run, actually. And it's not like the people... As these people get more uh, XP... Um, let's get rid of this. 1,500. Um, we 
we can't afford it anyway. We need more heirlooms, not more money. We can't buy heirlooms. That's the annoying thing. I mean, no, camping skills is way off. Um, I, I was saying, as these people get more XP, they're more valuable. We can't just replace them from the stagecoach without upgrading the stagecoach to the point where they arrive with that much H X XP already. So, I think I'm just not going to do anything right now except we're going to put the... Go here. Good. We're going to put this unit here. Wait, what have you got? Yes. Good. Don't know if that one with this one is any good, because you're going to have to move back, which means you're going to have to be slower than the Hellion, who is slower than you. So we can't actually do that. I'm understanding why minus trinkets are a good idea, like minus speed trinkets, for example, debuff trinket. But we don't need to take you. We could take. How are you in the second slot? Not so great. You're great in the second slot. You can come out again. Grand. Does this party have a name now? I don't understand when parties get names. By the way, it just happens. Um, what have you got? Healer's Gift. Warrior of Light. Warren's Scrounger. That might be good. Cove Scrounger. An unholy hater. There's unholy in the Warrens, maybe? I think it's all, um... Eldritch and, and blighted stuff in the Warrens. Warrior of Light. <laughs> Fine. Um, I'm ready, I guess. The Warrens is the... The sewery place and the weald is the swampy place. It's the old road. What's this? A cultist. We have got one of those. We've already got one of those. So I'd probably rather do this one just from the rewards. Let's see what we get. The warrens is going to be venomous. We only need one set of things. I'm going to do two runs in this episode even though that might end up uh, being a fairly long episode. I'm also going to take quite a lot of stuff. I don't think I need another key. And that's it for these as well, I think. And Master, we're taking... See, I'm <laughs> not quite sure whether I actually want to bring the Antiquarian to the Warrens, but the worst that happens is we die. Well, the worst that happens is we run away, and that's a lot of stress. But the Antiquarian is kind of expendable so they breed quickly down there in the dark but perhaps we can slay them even faster so i'm looking forward no oh, great <laughs> good start looking forward to a few scouts if we possibly can because i want to know where the room battles are room battles please not really into the old oh, it's nothing at the back um just hit it really hard Be gone, great fiend. start don't appreciate the um, bones being there. Oh, yes. More dodging that as well. You've got a hook, but you can't use it. That's great. Um, shuffle single or mark. Or just how much? 7 to 13. Can't hit that. Can you hit this? Stun this one. Because even though like on the next round we can whack it really hard and this thing we can just you know, it's two damage, maybe a bleed. Not even a bleed. So there you go. The other thing is, we have. Um... Actually, this doesn't have the. <laughs> what I expected. Flash powder, debuff target, less accuracy. Festering vapors, debuff target, less blight resist, which would be great. Ah, oh, we should bring this person. Oh. It also applies blight. Okay. Um. You're actually a very useful character. The other antiquarian skill that I like a lot is the party um, buff. It's a full party buff. Might as well stun you as well. I mean, now you two don't get a go. Perfect. And then... My go? Sure. More blight. I mean, it's only one blight per round, but it soon adds up. 
and then you get to just hit this. Of course, now I think about it, the stun wore off before you got your go because we didn't. Fine. Stun it again. <laughs> Fine. In radiance, right, it does something. It doesn't actually necessarily matter that much. I think the mark is not something you can resist, maybe? I really don't know. Oh! Don't like the crit. About to break. Not about to break, but miles off. We can take it. Um. Eh, stab it. Obviously, the Antiquarian is a, a timid character, not built for fighting. Built for, you know, collecting good no stuff. Quarter. So, whenever you have an Antiquarian, you're always going to get things like this. Uh, 500 gold mounted, each, you have to so keep hold of them, of course. No so, resistance. at some point, you're going to start wondering. I'm going to say no. I'm going to say no. Because we don't want... How? I mean, how are you that stressed out already? That's just not even funny. Scouting, no? I was hoping not to have to do this, but there we go. It's a trap. Scouting, Mind please. That such missteps are the exception, and not the rule. We have stuff for that. I mean, it's a pile of bones. <laughs> Probably, we're gonna guess that maybe putting your hands in a pile of bones is not the uh, not the recommended practice in all the textbooks and stuff. Rut row. Well, you're a bad. I don't like you already. That's stress. You're a stress one. Thank you for resisting the disease. Oh, the mark is fine. This is a dealer. Let's dodge. Nevertheless, uh, you're all going to be blighty resisty, aren't you? But we're going to be reducing it. Of course, you dodge. Didn't expect to dodge. I was looking at the resistances, but not the. Um, how far can you reach? Okay, so this. One. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Please. Oh, I mean, you're actually more hurt than you. I don't know which one of you is likely to take more damage, but you've got more HP left, so that's the important thing there, in my opinion. I need a bondage. Let's just. <laughs> I do like that skill. Didn't like that. Too much bleed in this place. No, no, no. Will you dodge something? <laughs> For once. Don't like this mark. Uh... How much damage does this do? 6 to 11. Can only hit that one. We might have to yawp. It does debuff us, but... We get that, which might be really. Oh no! <laughs> no, right. I only needed to do one damage, and it was enough. As life ebbs, I forgot to use terrible the. Vistas of emptiness I forgot themselves. to use the bandage <laughs> when it was your turn. That was my mistake. It's okay. I appreciate those two not getting a go, uh, and I appreciate this one dying fast. Nice. Eradicated. Poisky, poisky. This is not as easy <laughs> as it could have been. Um, that's not useful. Maybe it is. Human and beast. Don't like you. Dodging everything. It's got a very high dodge, but... I mean, come on. Mm -hmm. okay. Dodge. Nice. Everyone getting a go before me is just rude. Rude as heck. Oh. <laughs> okay. Stun. No, dodging explodey things. It's just not the done thing. Can you crit once in a while with your heal? Because you're so bad at it. I don't even know why I bring you. Um. Alright. What's your blight? Oh, God. You're not very much use. That's the trouble. <laughs> no dodge. So we'll just wail away on this thing. We might as well do something than nothing. That's the thing's the point there. You okay? Yes. Use use this. Cured. Good. As expected. Iron Swan this. Sure. <laughs> it's not good enough. We need sharper weapons. Dead. 
no point having the blinking there's no point having healed if that's gonna happen please don't resist it. right you're finally taking some damage you are gonna do an amazing heal oh, as predicted there's no such thing as a healing potion is the thing Ow. And then you're gonna have to roll a dice facing the abyss. when it's your turn as to whether the bleed kills you or not. Please just stop dodging stuff. I think that's the worst thing about these ones is how much they just dodge all the time. It's really, really annoying. Stop doing it. Um, this is gonna be... Three points around for three. That's a lot of HP you've got. And only three to six on that. Iron Swan. Three to six. Please roll high. We have no chance in this place. I swear it. We are out of luck. This is our first real battle against the enemies in this place. And they just... We have nothing against them. We have nothing that we can do. And that one's dead already. This was not a good idea. Let's run away. If this is the tutorial, retreat is unavailable. I mean, we uh, we can't we can't win. Retreat failed. Your turn. <laughs> run away. We can't even run away from these bastards. Oh, where did that go? We're wasting time trying to run away, and um, we're wasting time. We can't. We got nothing. We haven't got our only viable unit. Now we run away. A wise Can we just leave. Losses and regroups. Now you're courageous. It's too late. We died. Somebody. Let's get out of here. Whew, I don't even know if I want to keep these people. But did I get? Do not ruminate on this fleeting failure. The campaign keep. is long. And victory. We did get to keep that, we so we did get something out of it, but uh, there was too much dodge, and we didn't have enough things that would counteract the. Oh, I'm bashing the mic. We didn't have enough things that would counteract the skills that the enemies had, which I just wasn't expecting how often they were going to fail to connect. If we managed to hit every single attack that we made, we would probably would have won. Um, but we didn't. So now we're stuck in this position the where. Poor caretaker. I fear his long-standing I mean, duties here have... We need a new... Effect. I mean, there's a Hellion as well. I really like them, but that was just terrible. <laughs> it's just awful. We could have a new... We're not really getting a very varied... Um, varied selection of... of yes. I'm trying to click on stuff, but I'm... Incapable of it. Uh, classes. I mean, that was the first Hellion we've seen, and it seems to be quite rare to get them. Nevertheless, at least we can probably upgrade one of these. Which means... Oh, well, maybe we can't. <laughs> Fair enough. Upgrade this. No. Um, you need to be put in for some stress relief. I mean, you went drinking last time. Maybe we shouldn't push our luck on that. You can have a thousand gold for this. There you go. Wouldn't mind another one of those. Was there one? Yes. A good healer is hard to come by. A sister of battle, so to speak. Bias and unrelenting. Sort by, just straight up by class. There we go. Mm. One sort by level, then by class. If that's right with you. <laughs> there we go. Uh, and then. I mean, what have you got? Let's actually pick based on what they've got now. Hmm. What haven't they got? So you're going to be good in the front, but you haven't got very many things you can hit. But this is a, a good one because it stuns and moves the first one. And it's a charge, right? So you start in the second position and charge forwards. And then we've got two buffs. But we don't have the one that guards somebody, which is this one. So that one and that one is like a defensive position. 
I wonder if we could have a mana arms at the front and a mana arms at the back. That might work. Because you've been at the back, you'd be a purely um, like a support unit. You have a riposte as well. And that marks. I'd like to buy that. I'm going to bring this this person along. The raw so. strength of youth may be spent, but his eyes hold the secrets of a hundred campaigns. Can you upgrade something you don't have at all? Is that what we can do with number one? Go with your buttons and you're not clicking and stuff. Yes. So we would probably want to unlock retribution. Which gives you a very strong front line position. Um, we're not going to use this because we don't have anything for it. But that seems like a decent unit to bring on something with um, one of these moving around type highway mans. Not you, <laughs> basically. This one. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you for watching. It's been a bit of a long one again because apparently I spent 10 minutes playing the game and half an hour talking about it. But until the next episode, thank you for watching this one. Do remember to leave a like and a subscribe and a good old share with all your mates. And I'll see you next time. See ya!